everyone, Meister here again. Yeah, it's not the weather strip uh, changing video, but uh, yeah, I'm getting there. Uh, I have to get a place uh, where I can change them because uh, it's not very good to change them outside uh, when the weather is right now. It's no. It's, uh, raining it's uh, sunny raining sunny so i don't know uh, when i can uh, change them but uh, this time i thought i will uh, make a little uh, how-to video about uh, how to change the you know uh, how to add the led strip uh, between the heater uh, line and uh, right now i have uh, one uh, led there uh, what is uh, shining from the side but uh, i thought i will uh, get a cord uh, LED strip and uh, put a full LED strip there. I have to remove the plastics uh, around the steering wheel and uh, around the speedo. Then uh, I have to unscrew these screws here, what are hidden here, remove the computer and then uh, remove the glove box because I have to disconnect the cables uh, what are moving like this, what are uh, moving the uh, valves behind the dash and uh, then I can uh, take this out and uh, I will uh, put a LED strip here uh, so it will be behind the heater and the cold strip so the lightning lighting is uh, uh, good and uh, it's uh, not uh, like uh, this uh, this this and this is uh, glowing up and uh, this is just uh, blank <laughs> and uh, then uh, uh, I will uh, try to get it uh, good as possible, but uh, I won't show you the complete uh, thing uh, when I have to take it out. When when I I'm taking it apart because uh, I've taken I've taken this uh, things apart before, and uh, I will put a video here uh, where it's uh, more details. Then uh, uh, I will just put uh, fast forward, no time lapse, and uh, then. Uh, when I get the part out, then I will show detailed parts how I will put this there. This is a cuttable, like, I don't know if you see on the camera, there are small cuts in uh, LEDs. And uh, I will cut it uh, for the good length. Uh, I think uh, I have to put a transistor uh, for the LED also, because when I tested it uh, with the uh, uh yeah uh 12 volt uh adapter inside it was very bright so i think when i will put it back here it's uh like a drl uh, headlight <laughs> so i will uh, i think i will put some uh, transistors between the power and uh, then it will uh, glow on a uh, normal light uh, not uh, very bright but uh, let's keep on going.
like you saw, I took the glove box out, I removed the plastics, uh, I fiddled with uh, one uh, clip what is uh, under the glove box, but luckily I got him out and uh, now it is uh, time to uh, take the central console out and uh, then uh, I can start uh, testing the LED strip and uh, how it fits and uh, anything like this. Before I had uh, one LED here, no, what was uh, pointing uh, on the strip, but uh, no, it's not very pretty and uh, it wasn't working as much as I wanted. Now I will take these out, remove the old glue here, <laughs> what was holding it, and uh, then the uh, LED goes here. No, I have to cut it on the right length. And uh, I hope the LED strip uh, lights up this uh, part very good. So it will uh, show beautiful. No, it's beautiful. It's uh, equal light and uh, everything is working. So let's test. Is the 12 volts uh, bright enough? <laughs> but uh, I've tested it before, so I will show you. It's uh, not very good on the camera, but uh, when I tested it, inside it was very bright I uh, maybe I will try mm, it's getting brighter yeah I have to test it now to put it behind the LED strip and uh, let's see how it lights up back there Like you see, I took the whole <laughs> center console out. You can see it from every part. Mm, this is the main one for the switches. And uh, the LED has to go behind this. But uh, I don't know right now how can I put it there. <laughs> because I haven't done it before. No, let's hope it's very not very hard. Maybe maybe I can take it apart more <laughs> than it is right now. There is a clip here. I don't know. Yeah, it's uh, one is here. I have to find. Maybe there should be another one. Yeah, there is another one down there. Uh, I opened the right side. Now I have to open the left side, and then it seems I can take the old thing apart. Apart. Voila! It's all apart. Then I can uh, now I can get more access to the strip here. It's a little worn out, but no, I will clean it up and uh, yeah, it's very dirty. <laughs> and uh, clean it up and uh, let's hope the 
light is very good here. I will take the center console inside and uh, I will uh, clean it and wash it because it's uh, it's quite dirty. <laughs> like you see, it's very messy and uh, I need to get it very clean. clean. I came inside and uh, took it all apart more, like you see. The one what was holding this was attached here. There's uh, one clip here, one clip here. And the uh, other clips, mm, yeah, are here. Here, here, no. Uh, you have to take them out and uh, then you can take this panel out. Like you see, it's very, no, it's quite dirty. My fingers are dirty, like you see. I have to clean all them up. Then when I clean them all up, then this part, this line here, here goes the LED strip. And uh, I hope the result is better. Uh, I, ha I can test it inside uh, with the LED, you know, 12 volts uh, adapter, but uh, when the car, no, it goes in, uh, in the car, uh, the current is a little different, but no, the final result uh, should be the same. But now it's time to start cleaning up. I will show you what the code uh, LED mm, is showing when it's uh, on a uh, 12 uh, volt adapter. It's very very bright <laughs> like you see like i said it's like a drl uh, headlight uh, but i tested it on the car and the uh, light is uh, much better than uh, here right now because this is too bright and uh, now i will start to put all them uh, things to back together and uh, then uh, let's put it back in the car this is the way how i put the led strip here like you see and uh, now I'm uh, putting it all back together and uh, let's uh, mount it back in the car. So let's see how it's how the final result is. Before when I put it back together I put uh, these cables wrong. I put them uh, under the plastic but uh, they go on the top so I wanted to fix my mistake and uh, show you. Now the upper plate is done uh, then uh, now I have to put all the casings back together and uh, then start uh, the wires, no. connect the wires and uh, this I can do inside the car. When I came back to the car and tested the, the no, strip uh, here, uh, I forgot, to, well, no, I put uh, some uh, wires wrong. So when I looked in the beginning, uh, when the brightness was no, normal, then uh, when I connected them uh, now, the brightness was very bright. Mm, I will put a picture here so you can see what it was before. But now I put an uh, extra transistor here. Uh, so it will uh, take the voltage down a little bit. So the brightness is uh, not that much because uh, otherwise when I drive uh, in the dark, it's not very annoying. So I don't want it. But now I will put the thermal cover here and uh, then I will connect the wires and uh, start putting it everything back together. Now it's the hardest part. Uh, now I have to get the cables in the right place and uh, it's it's a fiddling job. <laughs> My hands are already hurting uh, with these, but yeah, wish me luck. It 
is almost together. I fiddled the cables back. It's not a very good job. <laughs> I don't re I don't recommend it uh, if you don't have to take it all apart. But uh, now uh, the center console is back. I have to put the computer. I have to put the glove box back. Then uh, around the steering wheel and uh, no, the switches and everything. And uh, then I can see what is the final result. Am I happy with it? <laughs> Let's hope it is. Back the glove box, uh, connect it, and the lower part, uh, what covers the interior uh, heater pipes, what are under the dash, and uh, no. one, two, three things to go, and uh, then uh, I hope everything works and uh, no cable broke or something. <laughs> I don't want to uh, seem like a negative person, but uh, I've done it before, so I know what it, it is. So, I put the car back together, but uh, my <laughs> phone uh, battery died, so uh, the, when I put the glove box in, uh, the, no, the video ended there. But uh, right now, it's uh, uh, half past eight, yeah, and it's uh, getting dark here, so I wanted to show you the difference uh, between the... Uh, no, uh, what is original? Original is uh, there's no light behind the heater strip, but uh, here I can show you what is it right now. I hope it's uh, better to see. Now, from here it shows uh, the equal uh, light, but uh, when you see it from uh, from the distance, it's not very good. But yeah, like you see, the light is equal, and uh, there's no uh, extra light uh, coming from nowhere. And uh, the original bulbs are showing like it's like you see. Uh, one bulb is uh, out here. I have to fix it, but that's uh, from a, another time. Another time. And like you see, everything is working. Uh, the uh, knobs are working, and uh, I tested everything. And now uh, it is uh, time to finish this video. If you like these uh, how-to videos, what I'm doing, uh, no, equationally, <laughs> not sometimes, uh, then uh, hit uh, the thumbs up, hit like, hit subscribe, and uh, then I have uh, more motivation to do these videos when you are watching my videos. And uh, thank you, the subscribers who are subscribed already, because uh, the 1000 mark is almost there. Right now it's uh, 990 subscribers to go. But uh, yeah, I will add uh, Facebook and uh, Instagram here also. You can uh, contact me there if you want. But now I'm going back inside and uh, start enjoying the weekend. But uh, see you soon on the next video. Bye!